What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Strike Up Beer. Quick beer reviews with your pals, Alan and Rapid Dave and Rapid Dave. I'm Alan. How you doing, bud? Yeah, I'm living the dream, brother. I'm telling you. So no, they're a uh, non-alcoholic beer. We actually have two of them from the same place. Uh, this is Untitled Art Non-Alcoholic Juicy IPA. This will be the first one. Uh, 12 grams of carbs, five sugars, less than 0.5% alcohol by volume. It says 55 calories per can. Pretty cool. Ooh, so, best by 10-1-24. They got that on the can. Okay, so we're still good. Yeah. Uh, NA Juicy IPA was our first foray into the world of non-alcoholic beer, and we couldn't be more proud with how it turned out. Brewed with Citra Mosaic hops and bursting with, well, juicy tropical citrus notes and aromas, our membrane filtration technology allows us to brew fully fermented beer and gently remove the alcohol without losing the aromas and flavors of your favorite styles. All flavor, no alcohol. There you go. Boop. There you are. Let's take a look and see what we got here. Can art's pretty cool. Looks like some art on there, you know. Yeah, I mean it oh, makes sense, man, right? That smells well, juicy. It smells juicy, hoppy. Let me get a little clink real quick, and then we'll check. Oh yeah, this smells like a like man, a real like IPA, it, right? Like man, makes my pants go all weird and funny. They're mm -hmm. shrinking. <sighs> Not bad on the initial, but then you get that non-alcoholic uh, taste at the end. That in a uh, yeah aftertaste. It's okay. So this uh, Lizzie picked these up for us. It was during dry January. We just didn't get to him. Got him from a local bottle shop here that was like, oh, yeah. He was super excited about dry January and bringing in some NAs. I've never seen this brand or this uh, this brewer before until now. Yeah. Um, and she got me two of this one. And then we have another one. We have two from another brewery as well. So she tried to tr double up on a couple. All right. And uh, But, yeah, I mean, it's it looks good. Smells good. You got this beautiful. like It looks. It looks. Golden, and it's foamy as hell. Yeah. You know what I mean? It nice keeps a head on it. Yeah. Got good carbonation on it. That, damn, that's just gorgeous color. It's got Pretty that good. bite though. It's which is it's good because usually with an IPA you got to have that little aftertaste. You got to have that little bit of bite, a little bit of the aftertaste. That way it's not because otherwise you get that watered down taste, exactly. and you're not getting that watered down taste. Uh, you're just not getting a traditional IPA taste with it. Yeah. though. I do uh, like that. It's juicy though. They went. The it is very though. juicy. I yeah. do like that. I love the smell of it um it's it's not a bad option though mm -hmm. like this is if you're doing you know you're taking time off of alcohol this is a good option you or still you, you still drink. want that beer taste right yeah. or you just well, typically drink. if you don't drink you're not missing that beer taste yeah. right this is for someone who enjoys that beer taste right and you have a little bit of that with this it's a good option yeah yeah not bad for sure sit there and knock these things back when i say the uh what were you looking for? Yeah, 12 carbs, 5 grams of sugar. Yeah. At 55 calories, if you're counting calories. Carbs are a little bit high, you know, for a non-alcoholic beer. But yeah, I mean, it's a nice little can. Nice little action there. I don't mind it. Yeah, well, it if you're worried about the carbs on that one, our next one that we're going to have is their West Coast IPA. Uh, it's a West Coast style IPA straight out of the Midwest. Ooh. Our non-alcoholic take on the OG IPA style is brewed with Cascade, Centennial, and Simcoe hops for an old school citrus and pine profile. And of course, none of the alcohol. And then it talks about the membrane system again. Uh, this one's got 16 carbs. Don't lose your mind. If we're four pouring sugar. The same cup. We're pouring it in the same cup. It's going to yeah. be okay. It's going to be okay. No, no one's going to die. Yeah. Well, and 70 calories. Okay. So you're you're higher a little bit higher on the calories, a little bit higher on the carbs. Mm -hmm. One gram less of sugar though. Okay. So smells again a cool a cool can. I like the can. I, I think their cans are pretty cool. Look at this color. Um, this color's gorgeous. That looks if you're listening to this on uh you know audio only like Spotify, our heart radio, whatever, you can flip over to YouTube or Facebook, uh, possibly Twitter. And uh, you can see what we're looking at here, and it looks gorgeous. Yeah. Cheers, to you. Yeah, cheers. That's pretty good. It's okay, got, that's got more of a let's call it a robust flavor profile. Yeah, I, I like I like the West Coast more than the the juicy. Yeah, which it should, anyways. Most West Coast IPAs are almost knock your damn teeth out. You know, <sighs> if you get you get a wild one with a high IBU, but uh, but yeah, it's. It's quite good. And you can just get your tell you what, you can sit back and knock a couple of these, a couple of these back with ease. Oh yeah. 
That's and pretty you do, tasty. And though. you get that, you know, that traditional beer flavor, you know, the, the beer taste. You you want to have an IPA, you want to have something. You get that hoppiness. And the, yeah, the hoppiness. And you don't want to, you know, it's the end of the night or you, it's sober October, it's, it's dry January, and you just want a beer. You just want that beer taste. I need, I need to fix. Give me some beer. Maybe your kid's got a game and you want you want to you want to have a nice cold one while you're watching your kid, but it's <laughs> frowned upon to drink alcohol at the ballpark at nine o'clock in the morning. Um, so, so you bust these out. It's How's a, that sound? You just show everybody it's not alcohol. Yeah. You know what I mean? They don't, they don't <laughs> care. They still think you're free. Yeah. But in their defense, kind of. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, that's really good. It's got a lot more. A lot I, more I like action. the flavor profile on this one a lot mm -hmm. more for yeah, sure. Big thumbs up. I actually really enjoyed them both so far, but yeah, this one I think is definitely getting the extra, the extra yeah. thumbs up. You this know is I mean? a, I'm probably going to grab a sixer of this to have, you know, just kind of on the, yeah. Got, got this from uh, Lone Star uh, Beverages in Carrollton, Texas. Uh, it's one of our local bottle, bottle shops here. And uh, but yeah, brought, he, the dude there was really excited about bringing in some non alcoholic beers. They've got like two doors now uh, full of it. So, I mean, it's, it's really nice because you can go nice. in there and get that option. You know, you're talking like a year or so ago, it's, you know, it's kind of limited. And if you talk, if you talk three years ago, it was super limited, especially you can when get it came tools. With, yeah, especially <laughs> when it came to like craft beer. And then, you know, you're talking about Sam Adams, uh, Athletic came around, yeah, um, and several others, even local breweries here in Texas. Community's got one now. Um, they actually have three different ones, and then uh, one out in Bedford Turning Point. Turning Point did one. So Martin House did theirs with the THC, mm -hmm. with the with the CBD in it. Um, well, yeah, I mean, you're just talking about how yeah. it's catching on, where people they just, they well, want to really, take a break, but right? They, they just want, but they still want some beer. I want a beer. I just need to take a break. Yeah, and it's it's one of those things where as a business you need to adapt, right? Yeah. And if that's what people are wanting to do, give them an option to still come and see you. Yeah. You yeah. know, give them a reason to come and see you. Be like, hey, I know you're not drinking this month, so hey, we got a non-alcoholic here for you. Yeah. Excellent. And while you're here, grab some other stuff to go so you can have it next month. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, so non-alcoholic. This is a untitled art juicy IPA and the West Coast IPA. Uh, both big thumbs up. But the uh, the West Coast going to get that extra. And uh, I try it. And let us know what you think. Uh, you enjoyed it. Yeah, thought they were both great. Leaning towards the West Coast. The West Coast is the the winner of the night. So, hey guys, thank you for watching. As always, I'm Alan. Rapid Dave. Talk to you guys later. Deuces.